All right, it's about 11.39 right now. Starting the day off, we're gonna go take this front bumper off the car and unwrap it, look at the damage, get it to a body shop. The headlight's gonna be here tomorrow and we're gonna get everything done, so should be pretty good. We're gonna have a good day today. It's nice out and yeah, let's get to business. So yesterday was like downpouring super bad and I put, um, you know the, the plastic food wrap you put over your food when you like do leftovers and stuff? I put that and some duct tape on my headlight because I didn't want it to break even though it's already broken and I have to put a new one in. But I wanted to keep it working. I don't know why, but I did. So yeah, um, I'm, I'm gonna show you guys how we get to Moe's too. So we're headed to Moe's shop right now. I'll catch you guys as soon as we get there. What happened? <laughs> what the fuck is this, bro? It worked. What the fuck is this, bro? <laughs> now it doesn't work anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Take that shit off, bro. Nah, it worked, though. It was raining crazy yesterday. I had to. Nah, nothing was going to happen. Because you have the seals from the inside. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right, we're about to unwrap this front bumper right now. So this is the real damage right here. Put a big ass hole in my bumper. Cracks right here, crack right here, cracks down here, cracks over here. Man. All right, we got the bumper all unwrapped right now. It actually looks kind of good, I'm not gonna lie. But we're gonna bring it to the body shop now and then after that, we're gonna wait for the headlights to come in tomorrow and we'll finish off this video. The car should be back at 100% very soon. 24 hours later. So it's the next day now. And I'm on my way to Mo's shop to get this bumper put on. We didn't get the bumper painted. All we did was fix it because I knew I was going to wrap the car. So I have a question for you guys now. Do I rewrap the car in chrome or do I wrap it in white and put red accents? Comment down below. Please let me know because I'm about to order this wrap on Monday if I'm doing white. And I'm going to do satin pearl white super with red accents. And it's gonna, it should come out pretty sick. But comment below what you guys think, what you guys think I should do with it. And yeah, I'm gonna show you guys the bumper as soon as we get there. We got the headlight and everything you've seen already. And we'll get this done now. So all these little marks right here are just like this sticker left over that we just gotta peel off real quick. Put goo gone or some shit, it'll come right off. But everything else, bumper's clean on this side. It's just right here is primered and the hole's fixed as well. So there's no more hole. And then everything else is all fixed. So there's no more problems with the car. It's just flat. And yeah, I didn't want to get it repainted because if you repaint it, that you can't wrap it for three months because you gotta let the paint heal. So, to get every wrap white and go from there. But it ain't bad. Damn, this headlight is so clean. These headlights are second. You see why I would do red accents? A little red in every single headlight. So, I think the red accents will look good. But these headlights are insane. We got the badge right here, too. Take this out. Take this badge out real quick. Headlight's gone, the car looks naked right now. But I'm getting the other one put on and we go from there. We got the headlight in. 88 Illinois Ave, guys. You need any work done, Patterson, New Jersey? Come check them out. <laughs> it has been a very long day, guys, but let me show you a little update. Quick little update real quick. All right. Front bumper, on the car. New headlight, on the car. So, we're looking good. It's looking back to normal finally. A little bit, sort of, kind of. We definitely gotta do something about the this and this though. The color difference is no good for me. So if you wanna see that white, comment down below, let me know. Cause I think it may happen. I really do. White with some red accents will look fire. 
We already got the red, red calibers too, so should be good.